everyone greetings from jee krishnan i welcome once again to the third and final part of my interview with mr vijay b sharma in my earlier parts of the interview i made a reference to loudon county the uniqueness of loudon county it is considered the richest county since 2008 in usa understand usa has got 3300 plus counties and uh, loudon is the richest among them well, loudon county is located close to dallas international airport and it is about 30 kilometers away from washington dc the capital of usa again we have mr sharma a resident of loudon county for more than 20 years so he will be the fit person to talk about loudon county on behalf of gk tv i welcome once again mr sharma for the final part of my interview sir we heard about La- loudon county considered the richest see you mentioned county then you meant- mentioned city in usa you know, if we compare in india we have the administrative levels like states cities district and then we have the village panchayat taluks how the administrative levels in usa uh, administrative uh, agency which operate in us is uh, basically at a federal level as we know that uh, us is a combination of different states federally at federal level then states level then uh, within the state there are different counties uh, which they have their own uh, managing the county uh uh administration they make their own budgets and uh, uh, uh carry out expenditure for schools road uh, maintenance etc uh in addition to counties the administration is done by certain cities uh and the township level also there are admin administration where townships have their own uh, offices to maintain the local uh, close uh, uh, township uh, uh, infrastructure so in this manner i think so some of the states they have bureau bureaus to uh, deal just like counties do or city uh, administration does so this is how the administration is done where uh, they are allocated uh, different budgets at uh, different uh, agency levels and uh, carry out uh, the maintenance of their schools and uh, infrastructure within that cities and similarly the county collects uh, the taxes uh, like vehicle tax uh, from or uh, business license uh, taxes Uh, to uh, fund their expenditure this is how the administration is done as mentioned in my introduction loudon county is the considered the richest county on what criteria what are the parameters that made the loudon county is the richest county richest one i i think so the county uh, loudon county is a uh, the proximity of loudon county makes uh, it's unique uh, that it is very close to uh, dc washington dc where all government uh, congress uh, congress and senate uh, sits even uh, pentagon uh, defense uh, uh, ministry is uh, sitting uh, which has a very huge uh, uh, building and uh, uh, all the decisions are relating to defenses made in pentagon location which is still closer than uh, washington dc congress office uh, to the uh, loudon county loudon county is uh, uh, when i uh, moved uh, from fairfax county to loudon county this county was uh, considered as a green layer county that means uh, new constructions were uh, mostly not uh, permitted 
but uh, since uh, Fairfax County and Arlington County, which is very close to Washington D.C., they have become saturated. Uh, new constructions are not uh, uh, mostly done, or the the cost of uh, uh, living is much higher in Fairfax County and uh, Arlington County. Uh, then Loudoun County becomes the next target for development. Mm -hmm. And uh, particularly the data centers uh, uh, which are being uh, uh, basically made, constructed uh, by Amazon or uh, uh, different Google or uh, those sorts of uh, big corporations, uh, they have been uh, bringing a lot of traffic uh, to this county and new constructions are uh, brand new constructions, uh, residential, commercial constructions are making it much more vibrant uh, county to live. Schools are excellent. Uh, education system is very good. Uh, brand new schools are made every uh, uh, every year or every other year in a uh, in this this county in a different uh, locations so that uh, the young uh, children can uh, easily get the education required. So that's the these are the factors and particularly uh, Dallas International Airport, which has a very high traffic of uh, uh, visitors uh, uh, or uh, business uh, people makes it more uh, coveted uh, place to uh, rent an apartment or uh, live here for work purpose and uh, tr make a, a, a transit transition from here to their workplaces. So that's the reason I feel that uh, vibrancy of this county is uh, uh, becoming uh, bright day by day. Sharma, before I let you go, uh, let me ask you the final question. Any other interesting information you would like to share about Loudoun County? Uh, I'm a resident of Loudoun County, so I may be sounding a little biased, but uh, uh, I feel that this is a county which is a very uh, coveted uh, one in the sense that it's a brand, it's a new construction. 40% uh, of the data traffic is uh, done through the data centers. Uh, the world internet traffic is uh, done through the data center set up here. So that's why it is rightly said as a Silicon Valley of the East. East. Oh. So that makes it as an interesting uh, uh, county to live in and uh, younger population, new immigrants here uh, and cleaner uh, and brand new cities make it more uh, uh, interesting place to be here in this county and also we are having uh, metro projects uh, Silver, silver, silver line, which runs uh, metro until uh, Washington DC to uh, Dallas Airport. So, uh, moving from here is also getting more easier for those who are living in uh, other uh, counties like Fairfax, uh, Arlington, or Washington DC. So, I feel that Loudoun County is a uh, very good county, uh, very green as well as still developing county and uh, uh, people will find a very good place to live and work here in this county. So the real estate prices should be going up, isn't it? The real, est real estate prices are still not at the level of Fairfax County or uh, there are certain areas like McLean or uh, Falls Church, Vienna in Fairfax County where the prices are very high but it's still uh, affordable in uh, Northern County if you go a little away from uh, uh, like uh, cities in Percival or uh, Shenandoah so the prices are going to be affordable. So thank you once again Mr. Sharma for the valuable 
inputs you are given about Loudoun County, as we all know, USA is the most developed nation. In a most developed nation, we find the richest county, and we are given interesting information about Loudoun County. I'm Bigo G Chris TV. Thank you once again, wholeheartedly, for answering all my questions in all the three parts of my interview. Thank you. Namaste. Thank you so much. Thank you very much, Mr. Sharma. Thank you. Thank you very time. Thank you very much. Thank you, Mr. Krishna. It was a pleasure exchanging my good thoughts with you. Okay, with this interview. It is a value addition for my YouTube channel, G Krishna TV. Thank you. Thank you. Sir.